Well, now for the past 25 years, Mike Bliss has been practicing a very unique combination of comedy and magic, unicycling, and pickpocketing. That's right, pickpocketing of audiences. I guess he's in politics after all. <laughs> he's done that all over the world. Thank you, audience, for coming up and understanding what I was just saying. <laughs> Mike Bliss is here along with a volunteer from our audience to entertain and amaze us. Would you welcome the master of variety, Mike Bliss? Thank you, Governor Huckabee. I appreciate that. Like you said, I am Mike, and we did get a volunteer from the audience, totally at random. What's your name, sir? Rick. Rick, and where are you from? Wheaton, Illinois. Wheaton, Illinois, awesome. And obviously, you have no idea what we're about to do, right? No. Exactly, <laughs> I like it that way. We'll try something else. Rick, have you ridden one of these? No. Nope. Have you ever wanted to? No. <laughs> Same answer. I'll do the ride, and don't sweat it. Uh, yeah, don't, I... don't sweat it. <laughs> Hold on there for me. Give that smile to the audience, because folks, not only am I going to ride the unicycle, but I'm also going to perform a magic trick at the same time. Can you believe it, Rick? No, I, it's amazing. It's ama it is. <laughs> Hold back that enthusiasm. <laughs> now, I'm going to take the handkerchiefs. I'm going to tie them together. I just need a safe and secure place to put the handkerchiefs. Got any place I can put them? Uh, my pocket. Your pocket? Okay, we're going to... Oh, wait, that's a little bit loose. Oh, wait, oh, I found a better place right here, Rick. Look at there. There we go. <laughs> Suck it in just for a second. There we go. That'll fit better once you break them in. That looks good. <laughs> okay, now, I'm going to write this. I need you to stand strong. Can you do that for me? Uh, yep. Go ahead. Uh, All right. Okay, go ahead. Stand. Oh, you're doing it. <laughs> I missed it. Okay. I know what's going to help. Rick, what do you do for a living? I'm retired. Retired, okay. What did you do before you were fired? at and <laughs> I don't know. at and t at and t Really? Now, was that very physical labor or more mental with them? More mental. More mental. Okay, yeah. this is going to be physical labor. Yeah. Just help me get my balance. All right. Okay, All we're right. going to work together yeah. on the count of three. Here we go. One. One. No, I'm doing the counting. Oh, okay. <laughs> if I'm right, I'm counting. Okay. <laughs> One, two, three. Up like that. Okay. Well, oh, sorry. Let me, oh, okay, Rick. Sorry. Let me get my balance. Let me hold you. Okay, okay, come with, okay. Well, Rick! Who's leading this dance anyway? Rick! This way. Back the other way. Okay. It's a tango. Are you dancing or playing defense? Rick! Whoa, what are you doing? Wait, whoa, what are you? Hold on. Rick! No dipping. Okay. I don't know who is leading that, but I really want this hand down. No, no, not down. Removed. Removed. You thought ATT was wireless now. Okay. All right. We better go for the finale. Y'all want to see the grand finale? They want to see it. Rick, you want to see it? I do, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Just to relax. Stand up straight. Just stand up straight. Let's actually, before we do, let's find out what Rick's going to get for coming up tonight. Rick, for coming up here, you're gonna get, you're, you ain't getting squat. <laughs> I guess that AT&T thing is more of a hobby. Right. You have everything else in the back pocket? Nothing else in the back pocket? All right, we'll just go for something else. Well, oh, you, your battery pack is attached to that. They might, oh, they might chew up there. <laughs> okay, hold on to that. I don't want you to lose anything else. Okay. Oh, oh, that was gone before I got here. Okay. Scared me. Okay, we're going for the finale. Okay. Right over here to your right is the jump rope. Is, what? Oh, it's a jump rope. Okay. Do you see it? No. That's a oh, jump oh, rope. There, oh, there. Okay. Oh. It ain't coming to us. Let's what do go. I do with the belt? Here, here, put it in your pocket. Just put that in your pocket. We'll come get the, get that. Can you grab it for me? Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. we got some good buffets here. I'm sorry. Okay. Let me see that. You're being a great sport. One last favor to ask, and you're done. When I count to three, you start jumping. Are you ready? Oh, man. Wow. Oh. I'm just kidding. My insurance won't cover that. How about this? On the count of three, I'll start riding, and you can start running. Back to your seat. On three, you're out of here. One, two, and no. No, I didn't say three. Come here. Come here. I forgot my trick. My trick. I totally forgot. Let me get this out of your way. I do apologize. I'll have to do this one later.
she stepped. Woo! He wore me out. I'm gonna get my balance. I'm, what? I'm, what? I'm sitting on it. Rick! <laughs> Did you put that there? <laughs> I do magic, not miracles. Hey, y'all need to get that applause ready because it don't last long. <laughs> Here we go. Thank you very much. My bless, everybody. Thank you, sir. Thank you for not asking me to ride the unicycle, oh, first and welcome. foremost. <laughs> How long have you been doing this? Well, I actually started when I was three and a half years old. You're kidding. I'm not. I was at a preschool party, and I saw an older kid cut a string in half and restored it. I bugged my parents, and they took me to the library. That's when yeah. we learned to read. And I actually would practice for months and months, and I ended up doing magic for my own fifth birthday party. Now, that's pretty cool. That's that was right. kind of cheap of your parents, though, to hi hire the birthday boy. It is. <laughs> I saved them some money. <laughs> <laughs> you perform in Branson a lot, but you're also traveling all over the world. Yes, to, sir. To do I, I do stuff. tons of uh, corporate gigs and churches, outreach programs, cruise ships. Now, I did start out doing close-up. You want to see something real fast? Yeah. A quick close-up. Okay, <laughs> sweet. Um, obviously, let me, let's me let show the audience. We've got a deck of cards all shuffled up, mixed up thoroughly. And, all you know, I could have you just reach in the deck and pull one out. Sure. But every magician does that. That'd be easy. So I, it would be, but I want you to simply look at the deck, uh -huh. look at it, and just pull one out in your mind. Think of it. Look at the deck right now. Think of one. You got one? Got one. You saw one, boom, you locked yeah, it on it. Yes? I did. The number in the suit, don't forget. Okay. Now, be honest. Right. Think of the value of it. Don't say it out loud. Think of the value, whether it's high, high card, like a face card, or real low. Oh, okay, you just, you blinked when I went from high to low. So I'm gonna guess. I'm gonna guess that you. Oh, he didn't look at the band. Okay, this is good. This is good. I think you actually noticed like a high card, a couple high cards, real fast, like a face card. Now, did you change your mind? Nope, didn't change my mind. You, you like those high cards? Yeah. This is interesting. I'm just gonna simply cut the deck. Okay. Name your card for the first time out loud. You're simply thinking of it. What is it? Queen of Hearts. Queen of Hearts. There it is. Right there. Thank you, Mike. Thank you, sir. I want my credit cards back. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, everybody. Mike Bliss. And you can see much, much more of Mike's amazing live talent in Branson, Missouri. He's headlining on the showboat Branson Bell. You can visit MikeBlissComedy.com to invite him to your next event and follow him on Twitter at MikeBlissComedy. I hope you'll do it.